Hi kindergartners, Sunday is Mother's Day, so I'm going to read you the story, The Night Before Mother's Day. I hope you enjoy it. Twas the night before Mother's Day, when as quiet as a mouse, Dad told us his plan to get Mom out of the house. Her sneakers were set by the door with care, in hopes that her running pals soon would be there. Then out in the yard, there arose quite a crowd. Come on, let's go, girl, her friends shouted real loud. So mom in her sweatsuit and red baseball cap plugged in her earphones and jogged off in a snap. Away to the kitchen, we flew like a flash as if we were running a 100 yard dash. We measured and mixed a delicious cake batter, then blended the frosting, oops, way too much splatter. We made fancy cards adding our I love you's and a special coupon that mom sure could use. See, you can make all that cool stuff for your mom. When mom came home, she saw the mess in the sink. what I miss? She asked. Nothing, dad said with a wink. We children then nestled all snug in our beds while visions of mom danced in our heads. So they made their I love you's for their mommy. The next morning, we presented a giant bouquet. It's for you, Mom, we cried. Happy Mother's Day. She read both of our cards and after wiping her eyes said, a private spa session? What a lovely surprise. We took Mom to the kitchen where our spa was set up. Dad served her black coffee in an extra large cup. Don't wake mom up too early though. We rubbed her shoulders, we massaged her feet. Mom sighed and smiled, you kids are so sweet. I wrapped a towel turban to cover her hair. Then we dabbed on a mud mask, no mess anywhere. I painted her nails with glittery fun, a top coat of polish, Oh, wow, manicure done. Dad said the chef will be serving a divine gourmet brunch. That's a meal that comes between breakfast and lunch. So mom hurried off to go get dressed. We took seats at the table behaving our best. When what to our wondering I should appear, but the perfect model for mom of the year her eyes, how they sparkled, her brown hair, how curly, her cheeks were like roses, her skirt, very twirly. We raised our juice glasses and offered a toast to the world's greatest mom, and that's no boast. And it says, we love you, mom. Mom thanked us for everything. It brought her such cheer. She wished it could be Mother's Day every day of the year. So make sure you say happy Mother's Day to your mommies and your grandmas and your aunties and that you love them. Bye, kinders.